Hey guys, this is Durveshya back with another video and in today's video, I would be showing you some of the best settings for the best screen recorder or live game streamer, which is open broadcast software. So in this video, I'll be showing you some settings which are really useful and would give you a smooth and clear HD output video file. So without any further ado, let's begin. So first open your open broadcast software then click on settings again click on settings okay so what i would be doing is i would be going through each of the category in the settings and telling you what you need to change and what not so first let's start from the general choose your language set up your profile then notification area icon these are just personal preferences and turn on enable cursor over projector then second go into encoding and in encoder select into 264 as we are going to be uh, out doing an output as an mp4 file then check use cbr then check enable cbr padding quality balance put it to 10 and set the max bitrate to 8000 now for audio encoding select codec as aac bitrate as 192 format 48 kilohertz and channel stereo then the second thing or sorry the next thing is broadcast settings so in broadcast settings change from live stream to file output only in file output only select the drive or the folder where you want to save the output then replay buffer length set to 1 or whatever the default setting is then in replay buffer file path let the default file path be as it is next go into video and select whatever graphic card you have uh, i am still using intel hd graphics on my core i5 6400 so that would give you a really good idea of what or how these settings can achieve a great output then uh, in base resolution select custom and change it to 1920 by 1080 and aspect ratio to 16 by 9 so before you change any settings here you need to consider that uh, you must have a monitor with the resolution which you have provided here as if I have a 1080p monitor so I have see, kept the settings as 1080 and if you have a 4k monitor then you can also keep it on 4k for resolution downscale would show you would downscale or compress the file to a different resolution I have set it to none which would uh, give the best quality output then in FPS uh, I am recording this just for tutorial or screencast purpose so I am keeping it as 30 FPS if you are gaming then you may also change it to 60 or much higher than that next go into audio and select whatever audio device you have check show only connected devices that's just a personal preference and other all let them to be default in hotkeys this is just a personal preference where you can select which button you can use to start or stop your stream recording etc next in advance in the priority process priority class select normal then check use multi-thread optimizations and allow other modifiers on hotkeys in video select very fast and coding profile high and use Sephia I love 61 to 120 FPS entry in video settings checkbox should also be checked then go to quick settings and coder and let it be the default settings and next let me just check through if I'm missing something this is microphone 9 noise gate, noise gate which should also be left to default screen switcher I just have a single monitor so I would leave it here now click apply and click ok and that's done so the result would be an output or this video which I am currently recording is the output of the settings which I have shown you just previously so that's it for this video guys thank you and goodbye